Hey guys, welcome to a YouTube video. Today it's going to be, oh well, a YouTube video. And as everyone knows, I'm back here in D Queen, and this is what all I've bought so far. And luckily, I was able to bring a lot more with me than what I had last time. And it's obviously not just knives I've purchased since I've been down here. But first things first, let's go through the knives. First, I found an actual Milano switchblade. And she fires perfectly. It's not a Chinese knockoff. And then I found a pair of beautiful Case butcher knives. Case XX Chromium. This one's in really good shape. This one's not in that good of shape. But I'll try to clean it up. These two I'm going putting for sale. And then I found a beautiful buck knife at a flea market. Sadly, this box does not go with this knife. What's actually in this is a... Let me get it out. Is a Model 285 Bateman. Beautiful knife. It's discontinued. Always nice to add one of those to my collection. The box itself goes to a Vertex. So I'll keep the box anyway, so that way if I find one of these knives, I'll put it in it. So that was a good little good little piece to add to my collection. So those are going for sale. These I'm keeping. And then a friend at a knife shop here in the town gave me this to work on for him. And I'm going to get, he gave me all his information so that way I can write it down and I'm going to turn it into a skinning knife for him. He's a blacksmith. Did a good job forging this, but I'll definitely do my best to uh, finish it for him. And I bought a nice Justin hat. And I found this beautiful set of antlers. These are really huge. And luckily, two clients have actually wanted stag handles from me. And as soon as I get back, I got to work on it for them. And these are great because I definitely needed those. And I've also bought some clothes while I'm down here. I purchased these nice pair of Arizonas for my dad, since he needs a pair as well. Those aside. And I found this beautiful pair of red Levi's. And I love how toned they look. Only paid $10 for those. Those I'm definitely going to keep, because I love the color. I didn't even know Levi's made this color. Set those aside. And I found this nice pair of Izod jeans. Never heard of them. My mother said they're a pretty good brand. So that's why I bought them. Again, I can never go have too many. And then I bought this beautiful... Let me get y'all on red. Redhead jacket. Their Streamline series. For only three bucks at a flea market. That turned out really nice. The only thing I wish is that this thing had pearl snaps. And it goes great with my cowboy hat. Overall, it's a pretty good bundle so far. And I also picked up a chunk of brass to make guards with. That's These are the two items I needed to pick up was this and a chunk of brass. The brass is in my bag right now. I have forgot to get it out. But I'll get it out in the next video when I get more items. But this, I paid a really good deal for. This was only 10 bucks, and these are really huge. It's hard to tell in the camera, but these are a lot bigger than the ones I normally find. And these will make some marvelous handles. I'm judging from the size. I could probably make about eight handles out of this. Well worth the money. And I'm glad to get a new cowboy hat. I used to have one of these a long time ago. Ugh. So overall, it's a good bundle. I look forward to collecting more. I'll still be down here for almost a month. So this is what I've got so far. I hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, stay sharp and wish me luck.